Do you enjoy noticing license plates? I have been a collector for the last 30 years, and I like to share plates from my collection. Many have a picture or a story to tell, so if you're interested in state symbols and icons, history, geography, or just license plates themselves, let's go behind the license plate. In this episode of Behind the License Plate, we review Connecticut's Long Island Sound license plate. Like other specialty plates, it is available for an extra fee with the money in part going to a certain organization. This plate, which was first offered in 1992, benefits the Long Island Sound Fund. The Department of Environmental Protection distributes money from this fund to groups and nonprofit organizations, which in turn apply for grants for projects that benefit Long Island Sound. The plates cost $50, $35 of which is directed to the Long Island Sound Fund. The graphic depicts the Saybrook Breakwater Lighthouse, which is located at Fenwick Point at the mouth of the Connecticut River near the town of Old Saybrook. In addition to the lighthouse and the sound, the plate features a rocky outcropping in the foreground flushed with tall green reeds. Connecticut is printed in dark blue across the top, and the slogan Preserve the Sound, also in dark blue, is on the bottom. The shaded background, which is light blue fading to white where the sky meets the water, predates the background utilized for the 2000 base plate, which is the current issue today. It is the same background used for other Connecticut specialties, such as the Keep Kids Safe specialty. The Constitution State has used blue and dark blue on its plates consistently since 1957. Also at that time, the state introduced a serial with a dot separator, a practice which extends to specialties as well. Lighthouses have a long and rich history, dating back to antiquity. The modern lighthouse era started at around 1700. The Saybrook Breakwater Lighthouse was constructed in 1886 and became automated in 1959. In 1990, it joined the U.S. National Register of Historic Places. The tower is 49 feet tall, sitting atop a 32-foot tall caisson. The lighthouse initially included a basement, four floors, a watch room, and a 12-sided lantern room. It was badly damaged in the Great Hurricane of 1938, but survived and is still in operation today. Other states have commemorated lighthouses on specialty plates as well, including Massachusetts, New Jersey, Ohio, and Virginia. Mississippi put a lighthouse on its general base plate of 2008, partly in response to Hurricane Katrina. The Long Island Sound Plate has been a popular choice among Connecticut motorists. Thanks for watching. See you next time on Behind the License Plate.